Good morning, traders. Today is Wednesday, December 21st, 8.02 a.m., about 30 minutes before opening bell. I think that Santa has already started to load the sleigh, and he's using the channel bottom as a launch, <laughs> as a runway, okay? On the left side, what you're looking at is five minutes chart of SPY futures last night in overnight and pre-markets. It bounced off the channel bottom back tested twice once up down up twice now it's going back up there is no bearish divergence in the RSI or the MACD going up currently now I want to also say however this is on the right side is the VIX five minutes chart overnight VIX gap down okay be ready for a potential. I think it's reasonable because, I mean, look at right now, futures are up. You got to have some kind of pullback, right? It's got to be some kind of pullback. Especially since yesterday, VIX was down negative 4.9, 4.19%. That's pretty hefty. Okay? So I think you can expect some kind of response from VIX today. It, it was, that's not unreasonable to do so. Okay? So I think it's going to come back down and maybe to try to back test this to some degree, right? It's going to come down here, see how low it goes. Last night it, it successfully did it twice. So is it going to be a third time back down to the channel bottom? You know, with the VIX gapping down and you can expect a response? Uh, that's probably not unreasonable, okay? Let's go over to the one-hour chart left side, SPY Futures. Now, okay, on the one-hour chart, you see... I don't, on the MACD and price action, I don't see bearish divergence. Now, RSI, I see slight divergence. Everything kind of depends on this latest one, right? Because obviously this is an, on an hour interval, so it takes an hour for, for that line to solidify. Let's see what happens with this line, okay? Let's, let's just observe that as we go this morning, okay? So... Uh, one hour uh, for VIX on the right-hand side here. This is the gap, the blue star. I'm I'm now going to start uh, indicating numbers. Okay, like like I've always been here on SPY futures. Negative 20 is bearish, right, on the one hour. You start going below that without responding and coming back up like it did here, like it did here. You start going below that and keep going below that, that's a problem. That's bearish on the one hour, Okay. Uh, for negative 20 for SPY futures. For the VIX, it is negative 0 0.3. Okay? That's the VIX. And yes, it has decisively gone down. But as I've mentioned earlier, I think you can expect some kind of response now. Okay? Some kind of pullback uh, on SPY. On SPY. Right? Because the VIX, it's got to respond. I, I don't expect it to fall in a straight line. But you never know. Because I can show you, uh, I don't have one immediately available, but I can show you a big gap up on the VIX on, oh, I think it was 12.2 uh, or 12.5. It's one of those two dates. It hasn't gone back and filled that gap yet, guys. So, so although I would err on the side of caution that it's going to try to fill that gap today, it doesn't have to fill it today either, okay? But I would err on the side of caution that it's going to fill it today try to fill it today and not leave it for another day <laughs> okay so but the VIX one hour looks pretty weak look at that well below the one well below this line but again I, I it's got to try to come back I mean it's just natural right it's, it's just natural try to come back hopefully only to make an even lower high like compared to right here you know right there make a lower high and then con continue the journey back down okay that's that would be the ideal state and so that's all I've got for you guys this morning. Just uh, pointing out some things to look out for. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. But uh, yeah, Santa, I think, is loading up the sleigh. Loading up the sleigh. Let's see what happens. Okay. Getting on that channel runway. Getting on it as of overnight. So being sneaky Santa coming down through the, starting to sneak down through the chimney there. We'll see what happens. Okay. That's all I've got for you guys. I will talk to you again this evening on the Market Recap.